Thank you for visiting Bar Hacker. This is Abhyudaya Agarwal speaking here from team Bar Hacker. If you are taking the bar exam this time on December 9th, here is a critical piece of news for you. The BCI has released a completely new model test paper and a revised syllabus on 30th November for the next bar exam due to be held on 9th December. With less than a week left for the bar exam, examinees who studied the model test paper realized that the new model paper is fundamentally different from the earlier versions of the bar exam what does this mean for the test takers what are the sweeping changes that have been introduced a few days before the bar exam the study materials for the earlier bar exams which are still available on the website for download are not valid anymore unlike earlier bar exam questions 99% of which were asked from these materials the new model test paper for the current exam does not ask questions on the syllabus covered by this material you would not be able to answer the questions in the model test paper by using the old material there is no new material prescribed by the bci this entails that there is no clear indication as to how much one needs to study on the subjects prescribed in the syllabus given that most colleges have different syllabuses different textbooks cover different cases and issues it is difficult to ascertain the depths of the syllabus just from the name of the subject just think of the difference in content of ratanlal and dhirajlal's thought law book as opposed to bangya's the questions are substantially different in the new model test paper as compared to the earlier versions of the bar exam there are questions on legal trivia such as constitutional and jurisprudential history which you may have read if you have prepared for clat upsc or judicial services examination some questions test whether you remember specific sections of various statutes many are in the nature of general knowledge questions few questions test conceptual understanding and there are almost no problem based questions in the previous papers a fixed percentage of questions had to be mandatorily problem based this used to be over 50% of the questions while the academic standard of the questions is not necessarily very high to pass this exam it will be necessary to read a wide range of material unlike the previous versions of the bar exam the biggest challenge is to prepare yourself in the little time that is left before the exam there is a modified syllabus for the past 3 bar exams you had to prepare 20 subjects now there is a new list of 15 subjects what is even more bothering to the students is the change in the question paper pattern which has been without any notice to illustrate the point let's take a few questions from the new model test paper consider this how much space should be allocated to each worker in a factory 9.9 cubic meters 10.2 cubic meters 14.2 cubic meters or 13.2 cubic meters this question does not test your conceptual knowledge of labor law but a specific provision of factories act unless you know this beforehand it will be extremely difficult or time consuming to find the answer from the bare acts during the exam next question when was the first factories act enacted 1881 1895 1897 or 1885 This question is not asking you which version of the Factories Act is currently in force but instead testing your ability to remember a historical fact. Next question. Which English case relates to joint liability? R versus Arnold, Mehboob Shah versus Emperor, R versus Haynes or R versus Prince? This is a question on tort law. It should be noted that different law colleges teach a subject in different ways. Specific subtopics for each subject may differ. The case law used to illustrate issues differs and the prescribed textbooks may be different. Therefore, even if you scored full marks in your torts exam, there is no certainty that you would know the answer to this particular case. Next question. Which section of the Specific Relief Act deals with specific performance? Section 9, 10, 11 or 12. This question is testing your ability to remember a particular section number of a law, although this is a fairly important section. Next question which of the options is a ground for declaring a marriage void under the Parsi Marriage and Divorce Act impotency prohibited degrees of relationship non performance of ashirwad or bigamy interestingly many law colleges do not even teach the personal law of the parsis and any legal practitioner outside bombay 
rarely comes across Parsi personal law. Given this situation, is there a systematic method you can follow to prepare without study materials, with less than a week to study, and with 15 subjects in hand? What can you do to ensure that you pass? Of course, there is a way, and Bar Hacker is here to guide you. The BCI has so far acted in a completely unpredictable manner. Right now, the only useful direction we have on how to prepare for the bar exam is the new model test paper. Going by that paper, we can confidently say that while passing the bar exam has become more difficult than earlier, with the right strategy you can ensure that you will pass the exam. At Bar Hacker, we have been studying the new model test paper for the past few days and have discovered certain useful patterns. We have analyzed the different kinds of questions asked and have devised a last minute strategy for preparation that you can follow for outstanding performance. Please do not haphazardly memorize legal provisions and trivia. Following a well-planned strategy instead will provide you the confidence and preparation you need to crack the new bar exam. What is this strategy? Let me first explain how strategy helps. Did you know that 37 questions in the new bar exam refer to a bare act directly? If the model question paper was a real bar exam paper, all you needed to do was to simply refer to the bare act indicated in the question and answer it. What does that mean? It is essential to carry the correct bare acts apart from certain other study materials. At Bar Hacker, we are focusing on creating a list of most effective carry-in materials to carry with you on the day of the exam for our subscribers. Honestly, for an open book exam, carrying the appropriate material is half the battle won. Now going back to the model question paper, if you had an elementary understanding of certain statutes and carried the necessary bare acts, you would have found that over 60 questions are quite easy to answer with minimal time. Provided you can identify which statutes they pertain to, had the right bare act with you in the exam hall, and were able to look up the answer in the appropriate act quickly enough. If you look at the syllabus, the new one, more carefully, you will realize that you have a few subjects less to study than before. If you prepare strategically, you will also realize that you can leave out a few subjects so that you can focus on what is absolutely critical in less time. Last, you need some practice to be able to comfortably look up the bare act for answers within the time allotted. Please note that now you will have less than two minutes to spare for each question on an average. The time for the bar exam has been reduced from three and a half hours to three hours for the new exam. For bar hacker students, we are providing a detailed report on the new model paper that was uploaded on November 30th. The report includes a detailed analysis of the different types of questions asked and the methods to answer them efficiently. We explain which bare acts you must carry, which subjects you should focus on and how exactly to study them. This would be very different than how you would prepare for your college exams, particularly because this is an open book examination. We also cover how you can familiarize yourself with various bare acts for efficient test taking. We will classify the questions and teach you the simplest methods to solve each type of question. Our videos of test taking skills and open book exams have been very useful in the past. In addition, we will also provide you two mock tests in the new format so that you get some practice just before the actual exam. With Bar Hacker, you can now focus on studying with a strategy that works without undue stress at the last moment. Since the previous preparatory materials are still available on the BCI website, we also advise our students to go through the 15 subjects as per the old study material. There are also six mock tests in the old format available to Bar Hacker students. If you are already a Bar Hacker student, we strongly advise that you practice some of them. All Bar Hacker materials for the exam on December 9th will be provided online. To access Bar Hacker, please click on the Buy Now button on our homepage and submit your details online. You can either pay by cash or by a funds transfer. We collect cash from your doorstep from 16 cities across India. After you have paid, please email us a proof of payment at barhacker at legallyindia.com and we shall provide you with online access within 3 hours. Thank you.